咁啱啱講完呢 p r o j e c t Max 哇，好聰明喎、哦，識得放啲糖水吸引啲螞蟻，唔單止有糖水食，仲可以食埋啲蟲卵喎、哦。咁而家呢啲科學家就發現啦，我哋相信呢，喺呢 p r o j e c t Max 嘅祖先呢，其實係冇呢一個能夠釋放糖水嘅結構嘅。咁突然啦，發生咗啲事喎、哦，就令到呢，佢哋有呢個咁嘅結構出現咗啦。咁以下一二三邊一啲呢，係一個可能性嘅原因呢。咁呢個題目呢，就考返我哋有關於基因嘅變異啦，同埋自然選擇嘅概念啦，亦都要了解下啦，一個突變係點樣可以傳到俾下一代啦？係咪所有突變都可以傳俾下一代呢？原來又唔係喎。同埋啦，應用一下有關於演化生物學嘅概念咯。誒，咁我哋又嚟咗擊破啦。第一句啦，佢就話啦，有一啲。自發嘅突變發生咗喎，哎呀，好似啊呢一句兩 Sir， 望一望先啦，喺啲葉嘅細胞度產生突變㗎。咁你諗下啦，喺葉嘅細胞突變，其實係咪可以遺傳呢？其實唔可以囉，因為啦 ，somatic 嘅 mutation 喺啲 somatic cells、body cell 身體細胞嗰度做突變嘅，咁葉嘅細胞有突變啫。其實就未必會傳到俾下一代嘅，咁所以第一句呢，就已經錯咗啦。如果第一句已經錯咗嘅話呢，其實答案已經出咗嚟啦，就係二同埋三。咁啊，有啲體育精神啦，搞掂埋佢啦。第二句就話啦，基因突變幾時發生啊？喺減數細胞分裂嘅時候發生。嗯，我哋就覺得有機會啦，因為啦，佢產生出嚟嘅。reproductive cells 嗰啲配子啊，就有機會傳俾下一代，就令到呢個特性咧可以繼續遺傳落去啦。而喺減數分裂過程當中產生嘅突變咧，其實就係提供基因變異嘅一個來源咯。咁所以第二句就係正確啦。第三咧就話啦，有呢個結構嘅個體咧。比起冇呢個結構嘅個體能夠生存得好啲喎，嗱咁頭先我咪講嘅呢個結構係生產糖水、吸引螞蟻、保護自己啊嘛。咁保護咗自己，即係話啦，我少啲葉或者呢棵植物，低啲嘅機會俾啲毛蟲去生喺度去食我啲樹葉啦。咁我做 photosynthesis 做光合作用都開心啲啊嘛，係咪？咁呢個正正就考緊我哋有關於自然選擇嘅概念啦。因為啦，只要嗰塊葉係能夠產生嗰啲糖水嘅，其實係有個生存嘅優勢，係可以俾啲蟻去保護到我。咁從而啦，就導致到呢個結構咧係可以繼續保留落去，因為佢唔係多餘啊嘛，佢係有用啊嘛。咁所以啦，第三句都係正確啦。So in previous question we talk about that all、oh, the plants species eggs, wow, so clever they can secrete the sugary solution to protect themselves. So now we are talking about the evolution. It's believed that the ancestor of the plant species X did not possess the structure to secrete the sugary solution on the leaf. So which of the following are the possible reasons that could have led to the emergency of the structures in the plant species X? So for this question, we are checking the concept about the genetic mutation and the natural selection, and we need to realize how is the mutation being passed to the next generation. So does it mean that all the mutation they will be passed on to the next generation? No, no, no. And then the application of the evolutionary biology concept. So let's take a look at the answer one by one. So let's take a look at the option one by one. Simultaneous mutation. Oh yeah, 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 Mister Lung. It looks like the answer. No, no, no. It's the mutation of the leaf cells. The mutation in the leaf cell are unlikely to be inherited because the somatic mutation. That means the mutation in the body cell do not pass to the offspring. Okay, so that's the concept. We learn it from the molecular genetics or basic genetics. So. We because we are not using the body cells for reproduction, therefore this characteristic will not be inherited to the next generation. Therefore, option one say goodbye, and then we can know that option C is the answer. So let's take a look at the option two and three. Gene mutation during meiotic cell division. Ah, because meiotic cell division is the way to produce the gametes, the reproductive cells. So. For the mutation, it could have contributed to the structure's emergency, and the meiotic mutation are the key source of the gene variation. And the gamete can carry this mutation to next generation. Option two is correct.
and then option three the individuals with the this structure secreting the sugary solution they survive better than those without this structure you can know that if the leaves they cannot produce the sugar solution so they have higher chance to be attacked by the butterfly caterpillar so it's the way about the natural selection individuals with the sugary secretion structure likely have a survival advantage a better protection from the end and need to this trade pieces and then this gene mutation can be passed on to the next generation by the gamete so for the following generation they still have such features